Lock Hill, a walk through. She is 104 foot length overall, built by Alloy Yachts in New Zealand, designed by William Garden. Her mast height is 115 feet, her beam 23 feet, draft 9 foot 9 inches. New all grip paint job was done by Delta Marine in Seattle in 2010. Lock Hill was launched as Chanel in 1985 and has had several owners, all of whom it is evident have lavished care on her. The stern boarding access makes approaching by tender very easy and a step extension into the water makes this a perfect swim diving platform. The tender is a 15 foot Nuvrania with a 70 horsepower Yamaha. This combination was new in May 2011. The hydraulic opening lazarette exposes a huge storage area, bigger by far than normally seen on yachts of this size. In fact, storage all over this vessel is exceptional. Two by 12 man life rafts are stored just forward of here, and the dome arch contains a shower and floodlights. The covered shady den is unusual and appreciated. It is an ideal social area. In fact, Lock Hill has three public areas. This den, the wheelhouse, and the lower saloon, making it easy to find some peace and quiet from time to time. The main sheet and furling controls are here in the den. All are hydraulic, making sailing the ship a simple push-button operation. The wheelhouse. This is the social heart of Lock Eel. 360 degree view makes watch keeping easy and safe. whether formal dining for 10 or just relaxing. The bar includes an ice maker, filtered water, a sub-zero fridge, granite countertops. This area is air conditioned and centrally heated. In fact, the entire boat is climate controlled. Each anchor comes with approximately 400 feet of recently galvanized chain. They are operated with a remote control. A simple cutter rig with in-mast furling mainsail, furling Yankee and a self-tacking furling staysail. Her wardrobe also includes a spinnaker and MPS. Lock Eel is fast under sail and 200 plus miles a day throughout the Pacific was the norm. The pilot house helm station contains up-to-date electronics. Forward and sideward sonar was recently installed along with other upgrades. Her twin engines plus bow thruster make handling easy. Bow thruster is 75 horsepower with a new motor installed in New Zealand in 2009. Lock Eel carries six guests in two identical guest cabins plus the owner's cabin. The master cabin is a wonderful cabin. King size center line bed, wall mounted television, large cupboard spaces. Even in the worst weather conditions, this is a comfortable place. Bathroom, ensuite includes a spa bar. Aft of the master cabin is the ship's office. It has access from the deck as well as from the master cabin. Beneath the sofa is the steering post and emergency tiller. Guest cabins are twins and en suite. The starboard cabin can convert to a double. Both cabins have TV and Blu-ray. The yacht has a large movie library. Her engine room. Two Volvo Penta main engines of 300 horsepower each. Between the engines is the centerboard. This hydraulically lowers to increase her depth to 18 feet. Forward of the main engines, two generators, a 20kW and a 55kW. A new Aqua Whisper water maker. Her main engine and generator exhaust systems were rebuilt in 2011. A large spare parts inventory is carried forward of the engine room. The salon, a large, light, airy space. Dining table, coffee table, leather seating, big windows, lots of storage space. And of course, state-of-the-art entertainment area. The galley, it's loaded, all you would expect at home. Two Thermidor ovens, dishwasher, microwave, ceramic hob with fiddles, a large sub-zero fridge and freezer, washer, dryer. A chest freezer is also concealed in the salon. 
Forward of the galley is the comfortable crew mess, a captain's cabin with queen size bed and ensuite. Forward again are two berths with separate head. Access to the crew quarters can be achieved from the deck. Lochiel is a fast, comfortable cruising yacht. Her current owners have owned her for over five years. She's taken them through the Caribbean, Panama, the South Pacific, New Zealand, Hawaii, Alaska, and back to the US East Coast. She has done this without complaint and in total safety. She is turnkey and ready to go off again.